I'm going to try to show you how to use um, the calculator for Euler's method. Uh, so the first thing that we want to do is uh, press menu. So I'm in a uh, graphing window. And then uh, menu, graph type, differential equation. Uh, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to type in uh, the differential equation. So if you're in Y1, you have to type Y1 if you want a Y to show up. So I do Y1 uh, minus 2X, let's say. Um, and if I press enter now, it's going to actually plot a slope field for me. Um, so I press tab and then arrow back up. I can add an initial condition. So let's say my initial condition is uh, 1, 2. Uh, press enter and you can see it kind of fills it in for us. Now, here's what I want to do. If I go back up and you see here there's edit parameters. I'm going to click on that. So if you'll see solution method, Euler. So actually all that, those dots that you saw were actually, um, it was implementing Euler's method. And here's what we want, plot step. So if I say the plot step is 0.25, so say I'm doing Euler's method with a step size of uh, 0.25, press OK. And now if I go to trace, um, trace, graph trace, let's start, I don't know what's starting there, at 0, let me get to 1, let's see it, at 1, it's at 2, which is my initial condition, then each time I move, it's moving by 0.25, which is the uh, size that I selected there, and it's actually filling in uh, the estimates that you get from Weather's method, and that's what it's actually plotting, so if I go back in here, whoop, I go back in here and edit my parameters again. Um, what was it? Plot. Uh, if I make it 0.5, let's say, so you can kind of see the difference. Uh, you can see that the points are way farther apart, but if I trace them again, uh, it starts there, and then you move by 0.5 each time. And, uh, you know, I, I, you might get the sense from this that the smaller the step size, the better it is, which we already knew. But uh, I'll edit it one more time. So I can make it 0.05. I'm guessing this might cause problems, but let's try it anyway. Nah, it just fills it in a lot. Um, this is obviously something you would not be doing by hand. So menu, trace, graph trace starts there. And then a really tiny step size there. Uh, so that's how Euler's method is actually built into your calculator. and. Uh, I hope you find that useful.